Be sure to protect yourself and grab one of the VPNs listed below. There's also other great links below, and it would mean a lot if you could like, subscribe, and comment to support the channel. And also thank you guys who send a donation to support. What's going on you guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how you can access a USB device that's hooked up to your Android box. So if you want to move files over there, uh, movies, TV shows, whatever it may be, pictures, uh, because when you use ES File Explorer, it can be very pr picky on what it sees. So if you cannot see your ex uh, external device, this is how you can do it. So you're going to go to the, the link in the description and download uh, FTP server. You can look it up on the Play Store. So I'll do that really quickly to show you which version to grab. You're going to grab this one. Okay. The olive tree FTP server again the link is below so what you're gonna do is you're gonna open up the FTP server so once you got the FTP server open you're gonna be presented with a window like this you're gonna go to settings network interface and you're gonna put this on all or you're gonna pick the interface that you're using I'm using Wi-Fi you're gonna leave this checked you're gonna check show hidden files and then you're gonna come down the home directory you're gonna click and you're going to pick custom folder or you can pick external SD. If external SD does not work, pick custom folder. It's going to open up a window like this. You should see your drive here. You're going to pick it. You're going to go to select in the bottom right hand corner and you're done. You're going to back out. You're going to enable this. And then what you're going to do is you can use window explorer or uh, like I'm going to show you right now, I'm using FTP or FileZilla, and I already have the info in inputted. You're just going to hit connect, and there you go. So you can access your your card here. So as you can see, I'm on the, I have an external drive hooked up, and you can create a file. So we'll name it test.txt, okay? And then you could disconnect it. Okay, so obviously it's going to knock off the server on the computer. And to see if that file went through, you can open up ES File Explorer. Oops. You can open up ES File Explorer. Go to your 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 drive, your storage drive. Uh, as you saw, it's right here. Okay, so I went here. Here, and then there's that test file that I made so you can move and delete files like that you can even do it through Windows Explorer but I like FileZilla a lot better this is how you can access a USB storage device that's hooked up to your Android box I again ES File Explorer is a little picky when you try to connect and view uh, devices that you may have hooked up via you know a USB hub or if you have two drives hooked up uh, it can be really picky, so this way you can send over really big files and not have to keep unplugging it and replugging it and be able to access that device. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want, you can check out the links below and even join my Discord server. You can get help there, ask questions, talk, so on and so forth. Peace out. You made it to the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget, on the left is a video in Main Lake, and on the right, you can check out my last video again. Thank you for checking out the video. It means a lot. See you on my next one. Peace.